Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a very exciting video. Today we're going to be doing a H&M haul. I have been absolutely loving everything that's on H&M at the moment. I feel like they are just killing it this summer. They have so, so many gorgeous pieces in. I am obsessed. Hence why I've done so many H&M hauls since lockdown. I honestly cannot stop just scrolling on there and adding things to my wish list. I have a problem but I feel like they just have the cutest things in for summer and with the heat wave literally upon us I wanted to add a few more really really heat wave friendly outfits into my wardrobe and a few things that I'd be really really comfortable in in the heat so this is going to be a very very summery H&M haul all of their new in summer pieces so obviously I will be linking everything in the description box below and I will be trying everything on for you to see what it looks like for reference I'm a size 10 on top size 12 on bottom so I should have gone for like those kind of sizes but I will let you know as I try them on and style them up so that you can see what size I've got how it fits I'm also five foot in height I also get asked that question all the time I'm five foot in height so I'm a very very petite girl um so I will be able to show you what these things look like on a very short stature which I feel like is why most of you come to these halls is because you want to see what these things look like on an actual short person because let's be honest the models ain't short and what looks good on a model does, often does not look good on my body. So we'll be able to see what things actually look like on. And as I said, I will link everything in the description box below. Hopefully it's all still in stock. I know things have been going out so, so quickly at the moment. But if it's not, make sure to bookmark it, to turn your email notifications on. And they are actually getting things back in stock quite quickly. I feel like they're doing quite well at rolling over their stock and trying to like get things that have sold out back in stock quite quickly. So I think they're doing quite well. And with regards to delivery, it's a lot quicker than it used to be. At the start of lockdown, it literally took over two weeks, up to three, to get items. Now it's only taking about a week, which I don't think is too bad in the grand scheme of things compared to like some other brands. I think they're doing a lot better in terms of delivery. But enough of my rambling. You're here to see the clothes, so let's jump straight into it. So the first thing I wanted to show you is this stunning linen blend dress. Now this has been going in and out of stock like hotcakes. And as soon as I got an email to say that it was back in stock, I was like, add it to my basket. It is the most stunning linen dress I've ever seen in my life. It is the perfect summer dress to add into your wardrobe for really, really hot days when you just want very, very little on your top and you just want to be really, really comfortable and in something that's very, very breathable. So I really, really love this. It's got these stunning button details going all the way down, which I think looks absolutely gorgeous and really makes it look a lot more expensive than it is. This dress is £25, which I think for a linen blend dress is really, really good. I've seen some similar dresses to this on things like and other stories and they're about double three times the price so I think for the price of this it is absolutely fabulous and I am just in love with how it looks now I'm a little bit worried about length I think it is going to be a bit long on me but I think we all know as short girls these kind of dresses just don't come up to the length they're supposed to do on us but one thing I do really like is that it has adjustable straps so it means that we don't have to worry about the straps being too long and that our chests are too short and our torsos don't fit because you can adjust the straps which I think is absolutely fabulous on a high street dress I'm very very impressed to see adjustable straps so I'm really excited to try this on and see what it looks like I am in love with this Oh my goodness, I am in love with this dress. It is absolutely stunning. So, so flattering and just absolutely gorgeous. Now I'm very, very glad I went for the 12 in this dress because, I don't know if I said this before, they were out of stock in the 10s. Um, so I picked up a 12 and I thought, I'll be, it'll be better off it's like a little bit looser. I don't really mind. And actually it's not even that much looser. Um, this particular one is fairly tight like it comes up a little bit undersized so I think if you're going to go for this and you want it to be quite comfortable and a little bit like summery I wouldn't have gone for a 10 I think it would have been too tight around here I probably would have had quite a lot of gaping around the boobage area so I'm very very glad I went for a 12. Now lengthwise it is about mid calf which I think is actually really flattering if you're a little bit taller it will be more of a midi on you on me it's like a mid axi I'm okay with that I think it still looks quite pretty but honestly, I'm in love with it. The white is just gorgeous. It just screams summer. I think this styled up some cute sandals, a little basket bag, and a really cute summer hat, and you are golden. <laughs> now, the second dress that I picked up is the same style and in a different pattern, and it's this gorgeous lemon pattern. Now, you would have seen it in my last haul. I picked up a top with this pattern, and you guys went absolutely nuts for it. I don't think I've ever had so many link clicks 
ever like so many of you guys shocked that top and i was absolutely obsessed with it i really really loved the pattern so when i saw that they brought it out in a dress i was like i need that in my life and they've actually got loads of items in this pattern i'll link a few below like a few of my favorites which I wanted to get but I was like I can't justify getting like four or five items in the same pattern just in different styles so I went for this dress because I just think it's absolutely gorgeous and such a summer staple I just absolutely love the lemon pattern on it I just wish I could be wearing this in Portofino instead of in my flat but alas it makes me feel very very summery it makes me feel very very content so i'm very excited to try this one on i got it in the same size as the other dress they were out of stock in a 10 so i decided to get them in a 12 um and i figured that it's better to have them a little bit looser considering that you can adjust the straps i'd rather have it a little bit looser and a bit more comfortable especially in hot weather rather than having it just like a little bit too tight so i wasn't too worried about the fact that i couldn't get them in a 10 i just picked them up in a 12 and thought I feel like that will be okay but I'm really really excited to try this on I think it's just absolutely stunning and I think this is just gonna be one of my favorite summer dresses I could not be any more in love with these dresses they are absolutely gorgeous do they have pockets no no pockets unfortunately <laughs> I feel like that's always the first thing that you look for when you put on a dress like, does it have pockets but I'm literally obsessed with these dresses they are so so gorgeous so flattering and really really comfortable i think if i'd gone for the 10 it probably would have fitted a little bit tighter on my waist but actually i'm very very glad that they didn't have the 10 stock i think the 12 fits really really nicely and as i said it's a little bit looser so just a bit more comfortable for me but honestly i'm so in love with these lengthwise as i knew it would be it's pretty much a maxi on me it comes like not even mid calf like but not to my ankles it's like about that Far off my ankles I don't know how well you can see that but I'm okay with that I think it looks really really flattering and start up with a pair of cute little strappy sandals and maybe some sliders would be absolutely perfect for summer so if you saw my last video you would have seen the linen blend trousers that I picked up they've actually brought them out in a black pair now I I'm a big fan of black linen actually you guys know I really really love my monochrome outfits and like my neutral outfits and I really really love black I just think it makes me feel really good and I know in hot weather probably not the most practical thing but I feel really really confident in black I feel like it's very slimming very flattering and very very easy to style so when I saw that they brought these trousers out in black I was like okay I'm sold um and I really really loved the linen colored ones so I thought the black would be a perfect addition into my wardrobe they are so so comfortable and really really easy to style they are supposed to be three quarter lengths but on me they're more of like calf length which I'm okay with I think with a pair of sliders they still look really really cute so I'm a big fan of these I think they are so so comfortable really easy to style and a perfect addition for your summer wardrobe these trousers are an absolute dream they are gonna be my summer trouser staple I just know it pockets of course you can't have a trousers without a nice pair of pockets but I really really love them I think they're actually a bit more flattering than the linen colored ones and I think that's just based on the fact that they're black I know that black linen obviously does kind of come up a bit differently than white linen I would say these are a little bit looser actually than the other ones um, I found them a little bit tight on my waist, um, not tight enough that they were uncomfortable but just a little bit tighter. These ones are definitely a lot looser and a bit more stretchy. Um, lengthwise they come down exactly the same, literally just hitting my ankles, which I'm okay with. I think it looks quite nice and yeah, these are just a definite staple of my wardrobe. Now the next item you might be a bit surprised at because I feel like these aren't the most me item ever but I've seen them all over Instagram and I'm kind of obsessed and I kind of want to try out the style myself and also I feel like they're just going to be really really comfy for at home days when I don't really want to put anything acceptable on like to go out the house I'm just going to be indoor all days and it's hot and... I feel like these will be perfect so this is a pair of jogger shorts i feel like these are just huge at the moment like so so big styled up with a halter neck tee or like a racerback tee these are an instagram girl's dream basically so i saw these online and i thought i'm gonna pick them up give them a try i feel like they would just be the perfect little staple in my wardrobe when i want to look like i'm wearing more than pajamas but i'm gonna feel like i'm in pajamas so yeah i got them in gray they come in loads of different colors there's like black there was like a cute little like pinky mild kind of color there was cream but i thought i figured like gray is just such a staple and like just such an easy one to style such a classic color for like jogger style kind of trousers short things so yeah i picked them up in gray and i feel like they're just gonna be a great addition to my wardrobe these shorts are absolutely gorgeous i really really love these they're very very comfortable 
I mean, they're literally like a jersey kind of jogger material, so they're really soft. I went for them in a medium, which is like my normal, or is it a 12? I can't remember, I'm gonna have to look at the label. Whichever one it was, I went for my normal size on bottoms and they fit really, really nicely. I think it's a medium that I got these in, um, but yeah, love them. But yeah, I absolutely love these. These are definitely staying in my wardrobe. They are adding into, oh, but I really love these. I'm definitely adding these into my loungewear wardrobe. These are gonna be my summer loungewear staples. Now the next thing I wanted to talk about, and please don't get mad at me because you guys would have seen this in a video already, so this isn't technically new from this haul. However, I just wanted to tell you that they've now brought out this hat in a cream color, as in the cream tie. So I know loads of you loved this hat and I've had so many people shopping it, but I believe it's gone out of stock in the brown tie. They've now come out with a cream and I kind of wish I'd got the cream and I figured I can't really justify buying two of the same hat just for two different colour ties but I loved the cream tie I think it looks absolutely stunning I really really love these hats I show you I've been wearing them mostly like this where you just kind of have the the tie coming out around the back I think it looks really really flattering and then if you wanted to do it so that like if it was a really windy day and you don't want your hat to come flying off you can tie it underneath your chin and it looks so so cute and it's also really practical see the amount of times I've had my hats go flying in summer when it's got really windy when I'm just wanting to have a picnic and have a bit of shade over my head so yeah I'm absolutely obsessed with this I'm going to link the cream one down below because it is stunning and I really want it <laughs> Now the next item I wanted to show you is this stunning broidery on glaze top. I am absolutely obsessed with this. I saw this online and I was like, mm hmm need that in my life. And now it's probably not the most practical thing in the world in terms of a heat wave, but I feel like this is just a gorgeous summer top that you can keep in your wardrobe and even wear when it gets a little bit into late summer and through into autumn. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's a really, really lovely material. It's actually from the sustainable range. I don't know what material this is made out of but it's from the H&M Conscious range. And it is 100% bio something. Oh, I think it's 100% organic cotton. I can't find the English one. Um, it's all in different languages, but yeah, it's from the Conscious range, which I really, really love shopping. The Conscious range just makes me feel a little bit better about my purchase. And I really, really love how many things are in the Conscious range now. I feel like when H&M first started the Conscious range, it was quite like very select, it was a lot more expensive, and it was very, very minimal. Whereas now they've brought a lot more things into the range and a lot of their products are a lot more sustainable and a lot more conscious. So I'm really, really happy to see this one in the Conscious range. And I just love the embroidery on glaze detail. I think it is just the cutest thing in the world and I love it. I love this top. This is just absolutely gorgeous. It's so, so flattering. The only thing I'm going to say, I picked this up in a 10. I would probably size up to a 12. I think I might return some size up just because it is a little bit tight on my bust. Making it a little bit difficult to breathe, like when I take a really deep breath, you know, and it's just kind of like it's a little bit restrictive. So I would say you might want to size up in this top um, just because of how the material is. It's not very stretchy, um, but I really love how it looks. These sleeves are adorable. They are like this gorgeous, like open embroidery. And then the top has got kind of more of a closed embroidery. Looks so, so gorgeous. You can also, if you want to, wear it more of a bardo style, kind of like off your shoulders. I think that looks really cute. Personally, I really like it up here. Maybe like coming a little bit looser off my shoulders just so it like really opens up my chest. You guys know I love a square neckline, so this was always gonna be a favorite of mine. Now I've seen so many girls rocking these kinds of dresses on Instagram and I really, really wanted to try one because I just think they look absolutely gorgeous. But I've always been worried about being too short to wear these kinds of dresses and I'm gonna look like I shoved on my mum's dress. But I thought we could give it a try and I've got a cute belt that I'm gonna style up with it which I think might just like bring in the waist a little bit. But I am so, so excited to try this dress. It is just absolutely gorgeous. I love the floral detail. This is such a gorgeous, really like deep, kind of like pinky red floral detail which I definitely think you could bring this dress into September kind of time when it's like getting a little bit cooler you could style it up with maybe some boots and like a blazer and it would look really really cool styling into autumn so I'm very excited to try this dress on I think it's going to be an absolute staple in my wardrobe this dress I am obsessed 
obsessed with. I feel like I'm really living my best hippie life in this, especially with my hair in these kind of like mermaid way. Oh my gosh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's really, really loose and free flowing. I have sized down on this because I figured if I went true to size, it would just swamp me. So I've gone for a small in this one. I'm normally a medium at H&M and it fits really, really well. I probably could have even gone for an extra small, but I think just for kind of like comfort reasons and like to make sure that's really, really nice and loose and floaty, I'm happy I went for the small. So I'll start it up just as it is without the belt. Now I'm gonna show you what it looks like with the belt on. So with the belt, I think it dresses it up a little bit more. I think it makes it look a little bit more formal and a little bit more dressy. So if I'm just having like a really chill day in a garden or at the park, then I can just wear it without the belt. And then if I want to look a little bit more dressed up, I just add the belt, maybe some heeled sandals and you are good to go. So I'm absolutely in love with this dress. Like this is gonna be in my summer wardrobe for years to come. So there we are guys, those are the things that I've been picking up at H&M to add into my summer wardrobe. Honestly, H&M are just killing the game at the moment. I'm so, so impressed with everything they have in stock at the moment. And I'm also really impressed with quality. I feel like they've really upped their game this year in terms of quality, in terms of their conscious range and sustainability. I just absolutely love it. I honestly you'd think this was a sponsored H&M video. I wish. But I really hope you guys enjoyed all those items. I've linked them in the description box below so you can shop all of the items from this video. Again, fingers crossed that they're still in stock. I'm literally hoping and praying for you guys because there's nothing worse than seeing a dress that you've fallen in love with just to find out that it's out of stock. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to give it a like if you did. I would love it if you subscribed and came and joined me for more videos. I've got loads more summer hauls coming your way. I've got a few more like spring summer ones check, check out the archives guys i've got so many i've been doing so much shopping during lockdown i feel like i am the epitome of that meme where it's like everyone's saving money during lockdown and like, you're just over there like mm -hmm. <laughs> but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you on my next one bye